Hey guys, today I'm bringing you a video that I'm sure you've all been waiting for, namely the winners of the giveaway that I did with 54 prizes. Now, I've entered everything here, I've recorded the whole thing, only cut it into segments so that you can see who wins what. So we are starting with the AC4 Sentinel winners, and there's 10 of them, so let's just start with that. You will see all the names come up, and mainly this is just how I've done the whole thing. I will be contacting everyone in-game uh, regarding their prices, so don't start messaging me on a Discord until I've actually told you to. Uh, that is mainly because it is all too easy for people to pretend to be other people on Discord, so hence why I've told everyone to uh, comment with their in-game name and server so that I can actually contact them. Aside from the last three prizes, because the three times a week of Prem and the T23 E3 are prizes that Wargaming will actually put on your account, so those people will get a notification from me that they have actually won, but they will get their prizes directly from Wargaming. The rest, however, is through a bonus code, so for that I will be contacting people and I'll be seeing that the code gets to them. Now, I've done it all in order, which means that you can't tell me, like, I have that tank, can I please have another code for a different tank? No, you cannot. The reason that I've done it is to keep it fair, because if otherwise I would pick, like, a first 20 winners and they would all ask for a Cromwell B, then everybody else would not be able to get a Cromwell B anymore, and that would just make it very unfair. Hence why I've just done it all in order to make sure that everyone gets the prizes that they should get. Now, we are moving on to the winners for the Cromwell B this time, and there's 20 of them, so that is a bit longer. I'm not sure if I'm going to be talking this whole video, because that would potentially be quite useless, but I will come back to the whole giveaway thing um, as a whole, actually. Because, to be fair, I've been absolutely overwhelmed with the reactions that I've gotten. Because so many people wish me a happy birthday, congratulations on the 5k, and... Just so many, so many sweet messages. It was absolutely lovely. And it's actually kind of convinced me to just do giveaways like this more often in the future on my birthday. Because it's a very nice way to start your birthday with lots of random people saying sweet things and congratulating you. Because that is something that I'm quite a big... It kind of it warms my heart and it's just really good fun. Not to mention just the amount of subs going even higher, which is just... Absolutely amazing. I'm already nearing, not quite there yet, but nearing 6k subs now. And that is just so cool. So yeah, this is just definitely something I will want to do again, because it's just so nice to see so much positivity. And of course, some people are just ass kissing and don't really mean it, but a lot of them do mean it. And it's just really nice to read all kinds of nice things and just get lots, lots of happy birthdays and all of that. And of course it's not all pointless because at the same time I do get to give away a lot of free stuff and that is something I quite enjoy as well. But yeah, the next certain giveaway I'll be able to do will be at 10k, which is another milestone that Wargaming will give me something to give away for. It won't be quite as much as this because I invested a lot of my own bonus codes that I had for giveaways into this giveaway. Uh, but it will still be fun and free stuff is always free stuff, so there's nothing wrong with that. I'll just have less uh, winners to draw, basically, which will make the giveaway winner video a lot shorter as well, which means that I probably won't be rambling as much in that video. But all the same, I do love being able to give stuff away, and yeah. Now, all the bonus codes are not exactly tied to your account, so if you do have the tank that you're winning, you could potentially contact one of the other winners and see if they exchange, but be careful because... Like I said, it is very easy for people to pretend to be someone else and it's very easy to try and fake a code. So be very careful with that. But at the same time, if you do have a tank, you do get some credit compensation. And of course, you do get the 500 gold and a week of prem if you use it yourself. But you could always uh, think about giving it to someone, uh, someone that does not have the tank that you won. And then you get a kind of sort of paid forward kind of thing. Which, by the way, is a great movie. It's a sad movie, but it's a great movie if you ever want to watch something. But as I've been babbling, we are steadily moving closer to the end and we are now entering the small two winners section. And then I have another 20 draws to just blabber on about whatever catches my fancy. But yeah, I, this of course does have a dual motive, because whereas I do love being able to give stuff away and whereas I do love making people happy with that, 
It is of course also to help my channel grow a bit faster because these kind of things, it is not something that you can build your channel on, or rather you can, but then you have a pretty empty channel and no one will actually watch your videos except for the giveaway ones. But in my case, I've done this twice now, big giveaways, uh, once last year and once now. But it is a nice way to sort of like boost your channel and to get beyond that uh, that number that you are really aiming for, which in my case was the 5k thing. And I wanted that to be before my birthday. I'm just really happy that that actually happened and that we all managed to make that work together. And of course, it's not just that. Also, the tournament streams help with that quite massively. And I am getting back into the actual making of videos. But all of that, it takes a lot of time and focus and my health does not really allow for that yet, even though I am doing a tiny, tiny little bit better. But to give you an example, I had to split this video per sections of 10, 20, 20, 3 and 1 winner. And I actually had to restart counting again and again very often, mainly because my neighbor was making noises and it kept distracting me and I kept losing counts. That is how bad my focus is at this moment. But I am seeing my specialist again by the end of the month, so hopefully that will help me get m uh, my medication adjusted again. And then we have to wait several weeks again before I actually feel that and all that. I won't bore you with all the medical details, but we are still working towards making me feel better, basically. So then hopefully videos will become less of a chore and more of a joy because I do love making them, but it just costs so much quite literary and energy and everything to do that right now. So I will be focusing on getting at least one out per week, uh, hopefully two, because two or three would be the main goal. That's what I've always wanted to do because it keeps being a hobby for me, YouTube. I love doing it, but it's not like a massive part of my life. I do have a job and I do have other hobbies and I do have a life in general. But overall, I will definitely try to um, get giveaways more often as well because it's just great fun. And at least once a year and I'll probably like I said we'll start doing them on my birthday because all the positivity and all the sweet comments it's just a very nice way to celebrate your birthday and of course next year I'll be turning 35 so that is a bit of a milestone on its own as well and it will be after Tankfest again so hopefully I'll have more bonus codes again and can make it a proper worthy of uh, whatever milestone we're celebrating then giveaway so now we are moving on to the week of Prem winner. There's only three of them, so that is not that many at least. And as I said, these weeks of Prem will be credited to people's accounts directly. So I will contact them to say that you have won, but you don't have to actually do anything to get your prize. You just have to be patient because Wargaming isn't always the fastest with assigning prizes. So please be patient with that. And if it takes too long, be sure to message me about it. So as the last one here is being picked, we are moving on to the grand prize, which is the T23 E3. And that will be in uh, credit to the account directly as well. So massive congratulations to Blackbeard for winning that. That is it for this giveaway. I hope you guys all enjoyed it. Thank you all so much for the subs and massively thank you for all the sweet comments and the happy birthdays. And I'll see you guys the next time again.